guys welcome back to my youtube channel sorry christian here with a beautiful fresh tipping face and if you're coming across my channel for the very first time you're highly welcome if you're a returning subscriber you're welcome back as well today's video i'm going to be talking about the almighty big brother reunion yes yesterday's video or yesterday's episode was more like the episode i've been waiting for because i wanted to clear the air on what happened in last year's big brother between Puma and tega so yesterday kind of like some things were exposed okay we heard a lot of things you know from both sides and you know why they acted the way they acted because if you know if you watch people that last last season yes um you know that there were a lot of um, scandalous things that happened in the house tega of course a married woman was you know accused of having extramarital affairs in the house and Bomatu was really, really um, trolled when he left the house for sleeping with a married woman. And um, now they've cleared the air on what happened, why they did what they did in the house, and, you know, trying to justify their actions, you know, what they did in the house. So, yes, Tega was now like, of course, they asked Boma first. Boma said that, of, that a lot of people didn't know that Tega was separated from her husband as at the time she was coming to the big brother house. And I was like, my guy, my guy I don't understand like she told you and you didn't say anything about it like you just kept quiet and now you're just they're not telling us you know after the whole thing after the whole show must have ended you know people must have you know forgotten about what happened so guys as i was saying about this boma issue so when he was not like talking about you know selling a book selling a book on how you know he didn't know that she was you know that he he thought he was dealing with a single woman okay yeah he didn't he didn't of course she told him she was separated from her husband and then um, was dealing with a single woman and all that. So Ibukana asked Tega, yeah, asked Tega that what really happened, like, she still on one side of the story. She said, according to what Tega said, that prior to entering the Big Brother house, she had a discussion with her husband, okay? And of course, they had issues and they were separated as her 2020, before she came to the house, they were separated and she told the, the husband that, of course, you, nobody would cast apart from going to the Big Brother house, you know, and, um, she the husband knows she's crazy and all that she does crazy things and so the husband of, of course will understand what she did in the house and all that so it becomes like wow that means and why i why i'm saying all this is because she didn't even let us know that oh she was separated she got us the impression that of course she was still married but they were having issues there was nothing like separation there and another thing again I'm, uh, because even when she left the house she was now begging fans she was crying and begging the fans that she's sorry for her actions and all that but she was also she, has, she would have also told the fans that of course she was separated from her husband so she was justified in doing what she did she never said that and you're not saying it in the reunion i kind of think that there is like she's kind of misleading us like she's trying to cover up for her sins or cover up for what she did okay because and in nigerian context that yeah as a married woman in nigerian context when you are separated from your spouse doesn't mean that they are officially divorced okay let that be a that's there are, there are two different things separation is not divorce divorce is when you've gone to the court and you've officially dissolved your marriage they're not legally they're not binding nothing is um, so both of you are officially and legally separated to do whatever you want to do but separate your know, separation without divorce say that you are just living apart but you are still legally married that's what it means so i don't know if she's also looking at that backing on separation to mean that okay she can do what she's, she she likes but not officially divorced you get my point so i feel that when you're officially divorced of course you can do what you want to do but when you're, when you're separated you still have you're still married but not living together so you still have all your spouse some you know some kind of respect and all that so i don't think she respected her spouse in whatever she did Puma, because it was quite clearing that they had something going on they had an intimate session in the house okay so there's nobody can tell me that otherwise that there was nothing like that and then um, anyway this is like a lesson to every other person out there like if you're coming to the house you're married you're married don't say because you're married and you're living separately shows that you're not married okay legally speaking she was still married as at the time she entered the house although she was separated but separated in the sense that they were not divorced so they, they, technically she was still married but she was just separated from her husband so what do you guys think about what Tega said? Like, do you think that she was justified in whatever she did? Was she justified in sticking with Buma or do whatever she did with Buma? Or she was not, okay? So give your own opinion on this comment section, in the comment section below. And I'll see you in my next video coming up very, very soon. Bye.